Welcome back, everybody, to Falcon Place March of the Living, episode number four, and our run with Anna the Nurse, along with Boomer, our cat. We have finally met up with our Uncle Damien. We also have Olivia and Tara in tow. We have almost next to no food. As a matter of fact, we're down to four food, which is enough for one meal for all of everybody here. Afterwards, we are all dunsky. No way to feed each other anymore, so... I'm considering kicking Terra out of the crew just because, you know, at least it'll be like one less mount to feed. But before we make that decision, let's see if we can find a city. At the moment, we have to jump over to Damien's cabin. That's going to be our next quest area. There's a city over here, too, so we need to make it over here at least to have a chance with um, keeping Terra around. So, we have what? Can I, I could jump over here, right? So, one jump, two, and Damien. So, one, two, Damien. One, two, Damien. It seems to be just about the same distance, doesn't it? Yeah, so I, I guess we'll jump up to this one first. Alrighty. Ah, oh, this is actually a really tough run, man. <laughs> like, um, it's just, it hasn't been, like, really terrible, like, um, in terms of events, but in terms of resources, we just have not found enough food. Which is kind of weird, because remember what our run with Derek? We had, like, a six-person party, and we had all the food and resources in the world. With this one, it's been, like, really resource, like, light on the resources anyway. You see a man stumbling backwards away from a single infected. The infected has an assortment of knives and other objects lodged into it, like someone tried to pr repeatedly kill it. Uh, shoot it in the head? Wait and see what happens. I'll just shoot it in the head. Your shot misses, but it gets the infected's attention and the attentions of several other infected. Oh, come on! I was trying to do a good deed over here. Fuck you sometimes, game. Can't ever do a good deed for another human being at all. Alrighty, so, Anna, let's see about... Let's get a rifle shot over here. I don't even want to fuck around with these guys. You guys want to kill them as fast as possible. Maybe you have the big shotgun, right? You should. So, yeah, go in for a shot here too. Everybody else, just hold your. Damn it! Everybody else, just hold your shooting. I will hopefully try to get Anna to get a kill here at some point. All right, two down. Anna, if you can, finish this off for me. I could use the bat now, but eh. Why even risk it? You reload. Okay. Looking around, you see the man who attracted the infected lion on the ground, dead. You think to yourself that he's probably better off this way and take his weapon from him. And he had an old rifle as well. Eh. Well, this is another rifle, I guess. It's actually better than the rusty rifle, wouldn't it? 8%? Yeah, absolutely it is. Absolutely. So, um, Anna, you take the old rifle, equip that one. Rusty rifle, I'm going to give you off over to... Aren't you also an expert in rifles, Damien? Novice, actually. Olivia would be the one, but she's my shotgun person, so fuck it. I'll just give it to Tara. There you go. You reload, and map it is. Damien's- oh, we gotta do this jumping in Damien's cabin. I really hope Damien has some food in his home, man. Oh, come on. Come on, dude! Okay. Aim at the head. You gotta get this kill as soon as possible, and then Olivia, you do much of the same down here as well. And you know what, Terra? Back... No, you have the melee weapon equipped right now. So... Damien, back me up as well with this guy. Okay. Down. Now we just have the regular variety. Mm, and let's go for a... Yeah, let's go for a headshot over here. Olivia, once you're ready to shoot, get a shot over here, and then... Damien down here. Okay. Boom! I love it. I love it. Travel. If I, haven't li if I hadn't listened to you, she'd still be alive. You hear someone shout. Ahead, you see two armed men, one tall and one short, pointing their weapons at a third. Well, the two of you just calm down and think for a second, the third one replies. He's unarmed, and this looks like it's about to get ugly. Side with the armed pair, side with the unarmed pair. Ask for more information, ignore them, and keep walking. I really just want to ignore them, but you know what? I'll ask for information here. It's none of your business why we want this guy's head to roll, the tall one barks. Side with the armed pair, side with the unarmed one. Ignore them and keep walking. <laughs> this isn't really much information for me to go by. Like, how am I supposed to, like you know, side with anybody with this, like, lack of fucking information right here. Um, I'm gonna side with the unarmed one. I guess we could probably deal with a armed pair if we have to. You're siding with him? Over my dead body, the short man turns and points his gun at you. Unfortunately, we have no intimidating traits, so we cannot talk them down. We are gonna fight them. 
So, um, I hope I made the right choice here. They're aiming at Anna directly. So everybody just unload as soon as possible, wherever you can. Terra, you need a, a gun for this Terra, so let's get you. Let's get you the old shoddy here as well. Do you have to reload right now? You do have to reload, as a matter of fact. So that's not going to be part of my plan. How about the rusty rifle? You also have to reload that. Alrighty, Terra. Well, never mind. <laughs> You're going to probably set this one out. Uh, let's just reload you for the future, though. Reload, and then Damien shot over here. So you're over here. Over there. Damien down here. Okay. Okay, nobody took any damage. Perfect. We killed them. I did see a... Uh, we did miss a, shoot, a shot. I'm not sure who that was, but somebody missed. Thanks for the save, the third man says. Name's Sten. Mind if I tag along? I'm going to take him with me, but that's only because I'm going to consider leaving Terra behind if this guy's actually really good. So let me take him with us. This is going to be Sten. Let's find out about Sten. Resilient. Negative one damage received from melee attacks. Ooh. You save Sten from a very bad situation that he doesn't want to talk about. As long as he helps you in your journey, there's nothing to discuss. Intermediate everywhere else. Okay. Terra, I'm sorry. Oh, actually, six food. Where did, you, where did we get food from? Maybe Sten had food from him? I don't know. Where did we get food from? I thought we were down to like three or four. Oh, whatever. Um... <laughs> Sten's got a crowbar and a pack of cigarettes. Let's see. Crowbar's five damage. You know what? Let's give him the the baseball bat. And I also... Do we tag along with Terra a bit longer, or do we just get uh, Splitter on a road now? I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll have her along as long as possible, and if we have no food at all to give her, I won't feed her. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe she'll just leave on her own. Who knows? So, Sten, you'll be baseball bat guy. And you're intermediate everywhere else, so... There's no reason why at least I shouldn't give you an old shotgun at least, right? So, take that. Okay. You are using old shotgun, Olivia is using old double barrel, and Anna is using the old rifle. Stan, let's get you a bit closer to the action so you'll be right here. <clears throat> Reload. Everybody else? Okay. Map it is. Damien's cabin, finally. Hopefully. You better have some food home, Uncle. After a short trek through the woods, you arrive at Damien's cabin. It's not much, Damien states, but it's home. Come in. You take a seat at the table while your uncle retrieves a small chest from his back room. Was saving all this for a rainy day, but now it seems as good as time as any. Damien mutters under his breath, and he heaves the chest onto the table. Take what you need, lass. We'll be needing it where we're headed. Take the supplies. Five food rations. Eight rifle bullets and eight shotgun shells. Hey, it's something, you know? It's some food. It's not a lot of food, but hey, it's better than fucking a big zero. So we're up to 11, so hey, at least we have meals for at least two more, um... Two more big meals for everybody. So I could probably use some of that now for our four force people, or our, at least our first four people. I'm considering not feeding Terra, honestly. I, I just, I'm saying, I might kick her out and just hold on to Stan, Damien, Olivia, and Anna here. Okay. So, can we rest here as well? We absolutely can. So, let's start off by resting first. Okay. And now, if we're going to feed people, it's going to be... Um, Olivia and Anna for sure. And Damien, because he has to come along. So, I'm sorry, Tara. I'm going to... I'm gonna hold on to your feeding until, you know, we for sure get some more food or we send you on your way. So, there you go. It is how it is, man. Someone's gonna make these tough decisions sometimes and, you know, that somebody is apparently me. Cool. We're down to eight food. That's enough for two more meals for the four people I am potentially thinking about keeping as well. So, keep that in mind. Um, we have a city down here, which is gonna be one jump. Actually, how do we get here? I can make it here from here, right? Yeah. So, no choice but to jump here. Luckily, we have some cities coming up. We have one, two. Of course, we haven't really found many good things from cities in this run. I'm hoping this luck can change now because, man, food could be really, really helpful going forward. And now that we're up to five people, I think we're going to be probably doing for the 60-minute searches as well. It might cause us more fights, but hey, you know what? It needs to happen. A traveler hails you from a distance. Raise your gun and tell the stranger to keep his distance while you pass him by. Stop walking and ask him for a safe distance if he has any goods to trade. 
I'm gonna go with the trading probability here. Sure, I might have a thing or two that might interest you. <gasps> yes! It was a trader after all. Oh, food! Tara, you might get some food after all. <laughs> you might as well thank this guy, though. Let's see here. So, what can we sell this guy? Um, obviously, Pistol Boat's gonna go fuck themselves forever. And that's about it for now. What can we sell that we don't need? Rope? I'll, I'll keep all the, you know, quote-unquote quest items with me for now. Oh, this is something I really don't need. No, keep all that. Keep all that. Yeah, we'll keep... Actually, if we have the old... The baseball bat, I don't think we need the crowbar. Although, we could just swap the crowbar to somebody else. But the crowbar isn't really that great as well. So, crowbar... Go away. Okay. Double barrel shotgun as opposed to the old variety. So, hey, I want that for six credits easily. Who will take that? Olivia's got the old double barrel shotgun. We might as well give that to her. Or actually, Damien. Then we have two people that can hit for 20 with the shotgun. And Olivia's the expert, too, right? Yeah. Okay, so you know what? Olivia, buy that. I will give this over to Damien afterwards. So, Damien, you could probably get rid of your... Actually, wait. Let's get rid of the old shotgun. With Sten. And I'll swap over the shotgun to somebody else. All right, cool. There's a regular shotgun here for sale as well. All right, so let's, let's plot this out here. Anna will be rifle still. Olivia is going to be double barrel shotgun. I will move old double barrel shotgun over to Damien. So, Damien, we're going to move your shotgun over to Sten, probably. And then your left, Terra, with the old shotgun. I would pick this up for Terra, but the problem is we might get rid of Terra, so I don't think I need an extra shotgun. Yeah. And you're going to stick with the rifle. So, yeah, I'm not going to buy that after all. Keys are zero credits. <laughs> well, if they're free, sure. 21 credits will we have. Let's buy some food. And now we buy more shoddies, I'm going to say. And, ha-ha, <laughs> 69 shotgun shells, of course. Would you have it any other way? Um, as much as I would like to buy more shotgun shells, I think we are good now. So, that's it. Um, hey, I will feed you guys soon. Can we rest here? No. Of course, we're in the middle of the road. That would make sense. Map it is, and city's coming up. We should be able to get some rest here, at least, anyway. Ah, oh, fuck. I forgot to move everybody to the center of the map. Shit. We have Biter, Biter. You're behind. Who knows where the last two are at? Probably back here, though. Yeah, I think they're back here. So this one might be the single one. And you are a biter. Um, bite possibility is 50%. Yeah, I don't like that too much. So here's what we do. We're going to use Olivia to start shooting over here. Damien, start shooting over here. 30, actually. Damien, you shoot down here. Terra, you have shotgun equipped as well. You come down here. And... Sten, I know you're resilient, dog, so let's indeed test out Sten's resiliency by sending him out here. And then Anna, move back for now. Okay. Then Anna, get a shot over here, I'm gonna say. Oh, Sten got that guy killed already. So two zombies are indeed, or three zombies are down. We only have to have two left. So now we regroup here a little bit. Everybody just reload. And everybody just head back. Zen got that, um, or Sten got that one hit kill. I, I, I keep wanting to call him Zen. Zen, because um, Sten just sounds really interesting to me. Like, Sten would make more sense, but Sten? I don't know. I've never heard of Sten before. So I'm thinking of Zen. No, or not Zen. Sven. Sven. S V E N. You know what I'm saying? Sven. Um, anyway, that's what I'm thinking here. But it's not that. So everybody keep moving back. Reload. Olivia, let's get a shot over here. Damien, get a shot. Over here, Terra, help him out, and Anna, help him out. Nice! No! The noise! Should we flee? After all this work, I'm gonna flee, huh? Please do not lose anybody, especially anybody important. Flee, get out of here. Oh, we lost nobody, and we lost no items. Ooh, that was a close one. You know, after the first... I mean, 
I would have dealt with the first mob easily, but once the second one came around, it's kind of like, yeah, fuck that. At this point, I'm going to just be in like an eternal loop of fighting because I'll just make more noise over and over as we just, you know, fight everybody off, so nah. No thank you, sir. Alrighty. I know you guys are hungry, I know. Terra especially needs two meals, actually. Not just one now, but two. Map. Here's our city, at least. So, I hope here we get some rest and feed me. So, um, before we do anything else, let's get some rest here because everybody is just about tired anyway, so. Please find something. Oh, no zombies, thank you. Alrighty. Everybody's up and running. Cool. Let's, um, eat. For now, I'm gonna feed everybody at least once because I'm a, I'm a good guy sometimes. Now, Tara needs one more meal and Sten needs a bit more food, but we're down to six food. We have five people. Tara, you're once again on the chopping block here. Just giving you a heads up. Scavenge. You better hope grocery store pays off. We're going to go 60 minutes over here. We'll probably get into a fight, but as long as it gives me good food, I'll deal with the fight. You better give me good food. We have six zombies to fight off here. So, Anna, you'll start off with this guy. Olivia, you should be able to get a one-hit kill on this guy here, and then Damien, you should do the same with this guy down here. Terra, you will follow it up with maybe Homeboy in the back. And Stan, we'll hook you up here pretty soon, dog. Okay, three down. This guy's left over. Damien should kill him, I'm gonna say. So now, Olivia goes in for a shot here. Terra is done as well, so Terra go for a shot here to finish it off, and then Sten, melee blast guy. Alrighty, cool. So I think we took like two hits with Sten, but because of his resiliency ability, he only took one damage, which is relatively fine. Four food rations, okay, hey, good. I will probably feed Terra again after all. So <laughs> there you go, Terra. You're eating tonight. Uh, let's feed her now, get that shit out of the way here. So Terra gets to eat. There you go. Alrighty. Reload, 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 reload. Scavenge. Let's go to the police station. I think 40 for 31 is a pretty good trade-off. I'm really liking the Sten character as well. The, uh, the whole ability of not taking damage that much is actually really decent. Oh, but good. Now we have to deal with... 8 zombies, of course. Of course. Well, luckily... Let's try to go for some one-shot kills here. So you take care of um, this grabber. Olivia. Zombie 1. Terra, zombie 2. And then Damien, zombie 3. And Sten, just hang out for a bit longer. I'll figure out what to do with you here pretty soon. Right. A lot of zombies still alive. Only one down, really? Let's go for it, Sten. Yeah! My man! Um, fuck it, dog. Keep at it, I guess. <laughs> You're the only reliable one here right now. Who's this guy? That's homeboy right here. Go after him, sure. Okay. Um, hey, everybody else that's not Sten, run. Come on, buddy. There you go, good. Excuse me? Is it because we made noise or what? There's some more zombies coming up here now. The noise level is just way too fucking high. Because we rely on shotguns so much, I guess. Uh, shit. Go after this guy. Anna, once you're over there, see if you can get a headshot on this piece of shit here. Alrighty. I'm going to rely on Sen for this one alone. He's going to put the team on his back right now. Do it, Sten. And Anna, just keep helping me out, too. Putting the team on his back, yo. Put the team on your back, Sven. Just do it, man. Nope. Nope. Go, Sven. Please. Noise level's back down at least. Come on, buddy. All right, good. Over here. Everybody run. Let our boy Sten deal with this shit. He's the guy. He's the hero that we deserve. <laughs> there you go. Hey. We got some ammunition out of it at least, so that's pretty good. I'm telling you, Terra, your stock is dropping so much with Sten around. <laughs> this guy is so good now. Scavenge. Let's go into hospital and try to get some medication for Sten over time as well. That would be useful. So hospital will do 
Uh, four, you know what? I'll do the 15% chance. 40's a bit too high up. A little bit too high. Oh, good. Doesn't really fucking matter now, does it? Oh, and, uh, nothing but grabbers. That's swell. So much for Sten being my MVP now. And now let's start off with a shot back here. Olivia over here. Terra here. And then you over here. Okay. Two down, one really hurt. Okay. I'm not gonna shoot anymore for a bit here. You gotta let this noise level drop down a bit, so we just move back, let the noise level drop, and then we'll go back into shooting again. I guess this is one way to deal with the shotgun usage as well. And now let's see about getting a kill on homeboy back here, Olivia. Let's see about finishing off this guy. Terra up here. Damien, follow it up. Okay. Two left. Is it Sten's time to shine? You damn right it is. No more noise, guys, please. Actually, Olivia isn't too loud with her headshots, so... Oh, nice. Oh, good. We got nothing out of this as well. That's great. Reload. Scavenge. Drugstore. 20 for 27. I mean, I would love some bandages for Sten in the future here. That'll do as well. And you know what, Anna? Wait. Would Anna? Wait a minute. Nurse. Plus one HP when using healing item at any group member. Ah, any group member. So that'll basically... So Sten will be able to heal from 8 to 10. Because Anna just is... Because Anna's in her group. Okay. Gotcha. So... Inventory. Take the antibiotics, Sten. And scavenge will do apartments for... 40 for 34 isn't really too bad. No fight. Ooh, now that might be better than the baseball bat for Sten. Rifle bullet six. I'm like, I'm happy to see that. Old shotgun as well. Oh, did we ever move that other extra shotgun to whoever we're supposed to do? Like, um, like you have no shotgun at all, Sten. But machete, let's see. Yeah, absolutely. Much better. So equip that. I'm not getting rid of this baseball bat, but I'll toss it over to somebody else. So baseball bat, go out of here. Maybe Terra. Sure. Rusty Rifle, Old Shotgun, Shotgun, Double Barrel Shotgun, Old Double Barrel Shotgun. Why did I never equip this again with um, Olivia? Because I'm an idiot? Yeah, well, obviously. A double Barrel for you, Damien's now got the regular shotgun. I'm moving this one over to somebody if I'm right. I think it's Damien if I remember correctly here. Because that'll be like a one-hit kill on the regular biters at least. And then the shotgun probably goes over to Terra. If I had to wager a guess, so... Boom. Boom. And everybody's got a shotgun. For the most part, other than Anna and Sten. I'll give Sten an extra gun here, or just a gun. But he's gonna be machete guy, obviously. Alright, pretty good. Scavenge, we're done here. Let's, uh... We don't need a rest, right? Don't think we do. Nah, scavenge it is. No, I mean, map it is. We have another city coming up up here. So, do we go here or do we just come over here and go to the border? This is going to be one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, forget the city. We'll hit this one up and then go to the border. Because remember, at the border, we'll be able to trade some items anyway. So, we could sell any extra ammunition there for a couple of more items. So, that's going to be the best one. You come across a school with some lights on. Above it flies a sign that has SOS written on it, accompanied by an arrow pointing at the door. The sign must have been up for a while. It is dirty and covered in stains. Let me knock on the door. You knock on the door three times, nothing happens. You knock two more times, and this time with force. The door bursts down, and rotters come charging out. I figured that would probably happen, but I needed to give it a test. You know, you never know what the multiple outcomes in this game. Um, you take a shot up here. Olivia. Maybe back here. Actually, wait, wait. Olivia, go after the kill here. Terra, go after this kill. And then Damien over here. Okay, two down. Two left. Anna, get a shot on homeboy here, and then Sten. Time for you to shine, buddy. Get him with the machete. Yeah! Nice. Back over here, Sten. Map it is, and boom. 
Are we almost out of time? Oh, I think we're almost out of time. All right, so this will be the last map we're doing here today, guys, and we will wrap it up. We're almost at the third zone already, though, which is actually pretty cool. The road is blocked by a group of infected too big to fight, so you decide to take a detour from the main road. After fighting your way through a trail of tree roots and overgrown flora, you come across an old abandoned house. Long since retaken by nature's overgrown vines, you estimate it must date back at least 60 years. For some, reading, re for some reason, reading this over here reminded me of um, Neo Scavenger, that one mod that uh, has that little viney area or whatever. Ah, kind of really miss playing that game now. Uh, walking around the side, you find an entrance held shut by thick rope, which you carefully remove. It leads down by... which, by your reckoning, should lead into an emergency shelter or basement. Let's give it a try. Enter the shelter. You carefully climb down the ladder into the shelter. Unfortunately, it seems as if someone had gotten here before you, as the place has been stripped clean of any supplies you could have taken. Sighing with disappointment, you exit the shelter and return to the main road. That's unfortunate. Alright, guys, we're going to wrap it up here for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a thumbs up, leave a like. I will catch you next time.